what you want. Sissy in the block. I just wanna Okay, guys, I'm going to give y'all five steps to how to beat the off-ball CPU defense in my team and playing it online. And not only that, make sure y'all go crazy with the like button. All right, step number one, pick and roll. I'm going to tell you why, because a lot of guys like the off-ball with their centers. So what you got to do is use screens at all time with somebody using the CPU defense on you. All right, so this guy is off-balling with a center. So what I did was I call a pick and roll. So in this situation, what you do is you go for a difficult shot because it's, it's really hard to contest that as a CPU. So make sure you do a difficult shot at all times, especially guys like Michael Jordan, Kobe, you got Jimmy Butler, Kawhi Leonard, Stephen Curry, and Dame Dollar, and John Morant. So make sure you abuse the CPU defense because people like to sit in the paint. Okay, next is a pick and roll with the jazz step. A jazz step is very important on the pick and roll situation you if you're dealing with an off-ball defender because especially on my team because they got all fan quick first steps so it should be very easy to beat that but on playing online you gotta choose certain players to do that because most of the time they got gold quick first steps silver and bronze a lot of people don't know is that when you do a jazz step you're able to speed boost off the screen along with the jazz step step number two is backdoor cuts backdoor cuts in this game is, is very effective especially guys like the off ball with their center power forward small forward shooting guard point guard it doesn't matter they don't they do not want to guard you period so if, if you don't know how to do a backdoor cut on the PS5, you press L1, and then you, you select the icon who you want to cut, and you go to cut to the basket. And same thing with the Xbox, you press LB, and then you select the icon, and you choose cut to the basket. When you play a game, make sure you play cl close attention with guys that like the off ball with their point guards and center, because they refuse to guard you. So when you see that, make sure you hit them with the backdoor cut at all times. This is another clip of the backdoor cut, and this time I did it with LeBron James. You see the guy is off balling with Kevin Durant, he was not paying attention and he got caught off guard. So make sure you use that all the time with guys like the off ball. Step number three, you got to run plays. It's very important because I know a lot of people don't like to run plays. But you see a guy off balling too much, you got to run plays too if you want to. The play I use it is called the fist 92 side. It's basically a, a double screen for the arc and it's from the 13 heat playbook. Especially in my team, it's very effective. But on playing online, make sure everybody can shoot so that way you can expose the off baller or the CPU defense. Next, I'm using a quick four horn, and that play been there for years. I think since 2K18. It's not effective like it used to, but once in a while it might be effective, but you gotta learn how to shoot able to make that work. If you don't know how to shoot, you're in trouble. The next play is a quick 12 flare. It's from the Wizards playbook. It's almost similar to the quick four horn, but the difference is that you got more space in the corner. In this situation, you see this guy off balling with a center or a small forward. Now, two things you could do. You could drop all the way to the paint, or you could kick it out to your shooter. Now, I'm going to show y'all another one of the quick 12 flare, but this time I kick it to my open shooter because everybody collapses on John Morant because he's so, he's so much of a threat. So, if you see that, make sure you kick it out to your shooter. Step number four, you got to use the five-out offense. To able to do a five-out offense, you got to go to freelancers. You got to go to the Clippers, Nuggets, or the Bucks freelancers. Or what you do is you go to the Bucks playbook and you do ISO 5 out. Using the 5 out situation is, ve is very effective, especially in playing online where everybody know how to shoot, it's very dangerous. So a guy, if you catch a guy all balling against you, make sure you use that. Especially on my team, it's very effective because everybody can shoot. They big man, they, they small fours, it does not matter. Everybody had at least a 95 three ball. So it's very easy to expose it. Especially on playing online, it takes skill to expose it, but you have certain teams. Not all teams could do that. Most of the time, when you ISO too much, the opponent decides to off ball you most of the time. So look out for that. They're not going to guard you every time. So say you beat the CPU defense, pay attention to the, your off baller because they like to bait you in the corner. So they want you to drive or pass the ball. So you got to pick and choose what you want to do. Go all the way to the paint or you kick it to the corner. But be careful with the defense because he like the off ball and bait you. So watch out for that. As you see, I drive all the way to the paint and I got the N1. Step number five, you gotta have IQ. You see this guy is all born with a point guard. Make sure you pay attention to that. You kick it to the corner or, or depends where your player is at. You just kick it to the open man and you shoot it. The one thing you gotta understand is that once you practice your IQ, 
You you could be anybody in this game. It doesn't matter. It's my team on playing online, current gen, next gen. You could be anybody. The things that you have to understand is that not everybody is good at off balling, and some people are great at off balling. And then you got another person that's very annoying off balling. And, and sometimes I hear stories that even though the guy is trash and he off balls, it, they say lose to that guy. So this is a perfect video that that I can show you how to beat it, so you have no problem. So if you want to practice these things. Make sure you go to 2KU and go to scrimmage and do that with any team. Let me know in the comment section if this video is helpful or not.